The mother of the men accused of the carrying out the Boston Marathon bombings has said her children had nothing to do with it. In her first TV interview, Zubaida Taneva told Channel 4 News that both were set up and both were being closely monitored by the FBI. Their father said he'll go to America to fight the charges laid against them. Here's our foreign affairs correspondent, Jonathan Miller. In the search for answers, one question stands out. What radicalised the brothers Tsarnaev? What turned the eldest, the late Tamerlan Tsarnaev, into what one US publication has branded him? A human pressure cooker. With the surviving brother, Jokar, under guard in a hospital in Boston, journalists have descended on Makhachkala, Dagestan, in the Caucasus, to try to speak to his mother, Zubaydad, who was today under siege, overwhelmed. Speaking to Channel 4 News, though, in her first TV interview, she protested her two boys' innocence. What happened is a terrible thing, but I know that my kids have nothing to do with this. I know it. I am mother. I have... I, I you know, I'm, I know my kids. I know my kids. I really, my kids would never get involved into anything like that. And so I, I really, uh, there is no reason. So I, the first day when I uh, really got this message, I got really worried and I, I was kind of um, telling uh, that it is a set up and I was just really um, mad and ag uh, angry at, um, and at America. She and her husband, Anzor, an ethnic Chechen, spent 10 years in Cambridge, Massachusetts with their two sons and two daughters. Anzor, convinced that the FBI's got it wrong, blaming the bombs on Tamerlan and Jokar. I'm planning to go to America and fight for justice, hire lawyers, talk to the press and reach the truth, only the truth. Because if this is going to continue, it will end badly for the American people. If my sons are going to be shot without reason, what happened in Boston was certainly a big tragedy for all humankind. People died. There were lots of wounded. I'd like to say that in this problem, my children have been dragged in. Innocent, absolutely not proven. I have lots of questions for the FBI and the police. And Zor Tsarnaev repeated his assertion that Tamerlan had phoned his mother last week and told her that a US security agent had called him and said he was suspected of carrying out the bombing. The boy's father described how Tamerlan had been on the FBI's radar for ages. A year and a half ago, around 2011, they came to our home, two young people from Boston. They said they wanted to talk to my son. They came in, we sat down in the kitchen, them and us. They said we're doing preventative work. We check out all the young people. They said how they live, what they do, what intentions are for the future. They also said that here in Boston, we don't want our children to be blown up in the streets. That's their words. We want our children to be safe, they said. Was Tamerlan present, he's asked? Of course. They asked, why do you watch these sites? And he said, I watch all sites, Islamic and all the others and news. I read books and Pushkin and any, all information. It's out there, so I read it. It's interesting. But both mother and father go further, claiming they did several FBI visits. Yeah, they were monitoring him, um, and I know that because I um, I used to talk to them. They used to come to our house, uh, um, like um, two, no, three no, times. No, no. And then my so, my um, Tamerlan used to tell me that he used to talk to them too because they called me once and they wanted his number. And then, well, at, at such moments, I used to get really worried because uh, you know uh, it, it is um, my kids and I uh, it's mother again. So, um, and then when uh, the agent, FBI agent, called me back, he asked me, do you think that your time, in, like, Tamerlan could get involved into some kind of organization, you know, uh, like radical organization, probably, he, he was meaning. And um, at that time, because they told me that they were, um, they controlled, what they, they saw whatever he was reading. So I said, no, no. But if Tamerlan and Jokar Tsarnaev did plant the marathon bombs, their mother's assessments as wrong as the FBI's clearly was. Was there a fatal intelligence failure? Well, if Tamerlan was indeed on the FBI's radar, and if they'd been warned by the Russians about him two years ago, why didn't the FBI think to add two and two when they published these pictures last week, asking if anyone out there had any idea who these two men were?